Fairhope police say teenagers vaping with THC is becoming a dangerous problem, and they're asking parents to help them put a stop to it. As WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, officers worry the THC may even be mixed with something else after two teens at Fairhope High School got really sick. It's a trend Fairhope police want to stop. Truly, you know, the way drugs are going now and things are going around, you don't know what's in something like that. Vaping has become popular with teenagers in recent years, but lately police have found some of those vape pens are filled with something other than nicotine, THC. It's what the, I guess you call it the active ingredient in marijuana, you know, it's the derivative of that. And with those vape pens, the problem you run into with them when they got THC in it, it's a higher content. Lieutenant Shane Nolte says anytime their test kits turn red like this, THC is present. School resource officers have confiscated more vape pens recently than ever before, he says. In one case, two teens needed medical attention after vaping with THC. Nolte says other drugs could be mixed in, creating a dangerous combination. They weren't feeling good. You know, it obviously made them sick. It's something that you don't know what they're getting, especially in the days of fentanyl and all that's going around. We don't know what's in these or, or what could be in these. Police say the problem right now is mainly with high school students, but middle school students have also been caught vaping. That's why SROs are talking with teens and soon officers will meet with parents to discuss the risk and point out what they need to look for. We're starting to work on a few things to try to push this out more. Those public meetings will be announced first of the year. In Fairhope, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.